Hello everyone. I just want to give you an update regarding my YouTube account as well as what as well as what other videos that I that I may be doing later on this year. Firstly, my reaction and review on Fairy Tale Dragon Cry. I just want to say thank you very much to those who have tuned in and tuned in and watched it and to those who have subscribed to my YouTube channel already, so thank you very very much. Now, regarding Fairy Tale Manga Volume 60, I'm choosing not to record it as soon as I've bought the volume because of what happens at the end of chapter 518. You may have already heard this on my a description of the fairy tale manga videos that I recently did earlier this year. The reason why I'm choosing not to do it straight away in June is because of my as asperges. As some of you may or may not know, I suffer from high anxiety issues and Asperger's syndrome as well and regarding what Irene did at the end of chapter 518 when I first looked at the previous spoilers it gave me anxiety which is why when the chapter first got leaked I decided to wait a whole week until chapter 519 so I would knew what would happen next. I posted on the fairy tale reddit page when the cover got unveiled for fairy tale volume 60 regarding what regarding what chapters volume 60 will have and whether 518 would be the last one in there and someone replied back by saying yes and I replied back saying okay just making sure thankfully he understood what I was going through regarding my asperges and high anxiety issues regarding chapter 518 and volume 60 and 61 and I thank him for for, for that so thank you However, I will be recording a preview of Volume 60, so you can have a listen to it. But, the good news is, when I get Volume 61 later on this year, I will be doing a double video. So, you'll hear Volume 60 and 61 in one video, as well as some new original music that I will be creating for, for the manga videos which is going to be really, really good, and I am looking forward to doing more of that. While waiting for Volume 61, I will be doing a review on the fairy tale manga and anime series as a whole, because the fairy tale manga is reaching its climax very soon regarding the last arc, and I want to do a review on the series to show that my opinion is not only better than those who don't even like the show, all them all read the manga but also to show that i am looking at through in a in a positive way and not a negative way once i've once i've done that i'm also going going to be doing a separate review on my favorite arc of fairy tale which will obviously have lots of spoilers in it so proceed with caution unless you've watched the anime or read or read the manga i won't tell you what arc it is but i what I will say is that it is my favourite arc in both the manga and anime series and I'm looking forward to doing a review on it. And one other thing I want to point out, since Fairy Tale Manga is close to finishing and I enjoyed reading it to keep, to keep Fairy Tale viewers en en entertained and looking forward to a new, to, to, to a new anime series, which manga do you think I should read next? There's My Hero Academia, which I'm fully aware is already in its second season and doing the sports festival, but something tells me they may or may not cover the Stain episodes. So Stain, the tongue-looking guy. So if you want me to read from volume 6, from when Stain makes his appearance and make it interesting, in, in, case, if the, in case if the anime doesn't cover it, then just comment below. So that's one series. Another series that I think could be interesting is Black Clover, which has similarities to Fairy Tale. If you want me to start reading that, comment below. Other than that, that's all that I've got to say regarding my YouTube channel and the updates for it. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. And thank you very much for watching this video. Thank you.